I would like you to self-reflect for just a moment and ask yourself one question. How much pain are you willing to endure? Do you just like being comfortable all the time? Or are you willing to suffer through some things to benefit your life? For every goal that you may have or every idea that you may think of, there is an equal amount of pain and suffering that is the price to pay to achieve that goal or success. Let me give you a few examples. In order to get fit healthy, have six pack abs and be in peak physical condition. You must go to the gym and you must diet every single day consistently. And you must suffer through the pain of lifting weights, muscle growth, muscle soreness. You must suffer through not having the desserts, not getting the dopamine responses from the sugar, eating healthy and being consistent going to the grocery store and buying those healthy foods and preparing those healthy foods, meal prepping, spending your time and using up all of your energy, all of your time and suffering through that process to get from where you were to where you want to be. That is the price that you have to pay. You have to suffer in order to get from fat to fit. If you want to buy a home, you have to suffer through saving money. You need to suffer through cutting your budget, spending less money on bullshit you don't need to put away for the house that you want to buy. You need to live a humble lifestyle and just get down to the bare basics and you need to suffer through that period for one to two years in order to have the money from the income that you have right now to buy the house that you want. That is the price you have to pay. If you want to build an amazing relationship with your spouse or your girlfriend, you need to sacrifice your hobbies. You need to spend less time doing the things that you love to spend more time with the person that you love. You need to suffer through not doing the things that you enjoy to spend time building a relationship with that person. That is the price that you have to pay. If you want more money and you want to become successful and you want to become wealthy, you need to invest in yourself. You need to self-educate. Nobody's going to do it for you. You need to sacrifice your sleep and your leisure, do all of your obligations in life, and make the time to self-educate. No hours of self-educating is a waste of time. All of that stuff compounds. Learning how to day trade, learning fundamental analysis, learning technical analysis, learning algorithmic trading, then adding price action on top of that. Diving into Wyckoff theory, smart money concepts, ICT, all of those pieces of information and self-education compound to create the thing that you want. It takes a long time. You're not going to skip that. You have to suffer to get the goal. How much pain are you willing to go through? Listen, nobody is gonna do it for you. You have to make the commitment yourself. You need to commit the time and you need to understand yourself. How much are you willing to suffer in order to get the thing that you want? I suffered for years trying to figure this shit out. There was so much garbage on the internet, but I did it day in and day out. I sifted through it. I looked for the gold nuggets that exist everywhere in life and I put them all in a nice bowl in front of me and I learned how to day trade. I wish I would have had an old mentor that could have showed me exactly what to do so I don't make all the mistakes. He would have saved me a bunch of time and a lot of heartache, but I didn't have that. I was willing to suffer to the extreme to get to where I want to be. If you're hungry and you want it, what I just said motivated you to start right now. If not, nothing will, and you have reached your maximum potential. This is the pinnacle of your life. You will not get any better. You will not be any better. Enjoy cruise control for the rest of your life. Those of you that want to start now, go to trdfloor.com, sign up, look at our syllabus, and you will see a step-by-step process of exactly what you need to do and all of the things that I learned in the correct order to become a successful day trader. That roadmap, that syllabus guide, will shorten the amount of time that you need to suffer in order to achieve this goal.